welcome back to Crazy Kennel YouTube. In this video, I'm going to be showing the basic concepts of machine learning using the game Wow to Learn. So, if you like this video, be sure to like and subscribe. And if you're wanting notifications of my upcoming videos, please click on the bell icon. So, I think that this game is really neat because it shows, like, it teaches the basic concepts of machine learning and programming. So, in this game right now, Basically what it is, is we have cargo data, so there's 36 red blocks, 40 green blocks, and 26 blue blocks, and we had to get them to the stream, so this stream only allows red and green, this one only green and blue, and this one again only red and green, so basically we want to get um, all of these out in, the, in a certain amount of time, and we also want to get them in the right place, so basically we can't have a blue here, and then a red here, and a blue here. We need to have um, the right one, so we'll in this one only green and red, save for this, and in this one we'll make green and blue. So first, I'm going to put in a dis uh, expert system, and I'm going to connect the cargo data to that. So in the expert system, basically I'm going to send the red to the first one, and I'm going to send the else to a decision tree. So basically, um, what is happening is this is going to send a green green, blue, and red, and all the red is going to go straight to the output stream 0, and blue and green is going to go here, so this one, I'm going to make this blue, this green, and now I'm going to send this blue right here, and this green right here, so I think this is a really simple one, so let's see if it works, because we had to do it in a certain amount of time, um, get all of them out in a certain amount of time, and make sure that they all go the right path, so let's test run this. So it's giving us more time since it's not completed, but we're losing the amount of coins, in-game coins that we get. I think that's okay, but I want to see if this actually successfully runs. Well, I guess it didn't, so we ran out of time. So everything worked fine, except we ran out of time. So basically, we got them in the right path, but for some reason, they're not going really fast. So the thing about this is basically, it tells you the time it takes for the expert and the decision tree. So, I don't think we really need a trash can in this one since we don't have to like discard any of them. So, I think that the fastest would be the decision tree because this is 0 0.3 seconds and the expert system is only 1 second. So, I think that instead of this, I should put in a decision tree. But since the decision tree only can carry two colors, I'm not exactly sure how it'll work. But I can test it. For this one, I can only use a max of three notes, so I can't really put more than three in there. So I'm gonna try to delete the expert system. And I'm gonna send the red again right here. I'm gonna send the blue right here. Or instead, I can actually put in another um, decision tree and make it to where the red goes here, the blue also goes here, the red goes here, the or I can just make the blue go straight to this one, and this blue also go straight to this one. So following the path, it looks like red will go here, blue will go here, but since there's no specification for green, it'll go in either one of them. So basically, this path right here can have red and green, since we don't really specify green, since there's only two. And this one can also have blue and green. So I'm going to be ready for both. And instead, this one is going to be red and green. Green goes here. This one, blue, goes here. And potentially green also. And this one goes here. And green goes here. So let's try test running that. And hopefully this works out. So I think that this one we can't use the expert systems, or we can, but it'll run it'll run us out of time because since the initial tree is like 
one third, about one third of the expert system's time. It is much faster. And look at that, our launch is complete, so we successfully completed this one. And I guess that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching and see you next time on Crazy Cuddle YouTube.